first before I start this video, I want to say, Trump, you feel me? I can't say it how I want to because I got my little ones here. They listening, but everything else, I'm finna get, I'm finna get into, uh, I'm finna get it in. So this is about the government and Donald Trump replacing food stamps with a box of food. You feel me? I got EBT, you feel me? And I use it and I need it. They need to give us more than what they give us. First of all, you feel me? They take a lot from the people. So I feel like all of us, we deserve free food. We deserve free money. We deserve free everything from the government. Like they like they do us. They want free assistance. They want free information. They 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 get us for free all the time. You feel me? So anybody who's feeling like, oh, why are you getting uh, food stamps from the government? Oh, oh you, you, you dumb. You feel me? So I just want to let you know that right off the bat. So I don't want to hear none of that. And if you do, just just leave your comments. Go ahead. I want to I want to see the comments. But anyway, this is for them talking about replacing food stamps, like I was saying, with a box of food. And if anybody thinks that's a smart idea, it, you you're not really thinking. So I don't understand why anybody would want that, but I understand why the government wants to do it because they want to continue to poison us. And not give us any choices on eating healthier or not. You know what I mean? Like, I use my EBT to eat healthy. You feel me? We vegan. We go out. We go to Whole Foods. We go to Trader Joe's. We go to Sprouts with our EBT. And we eat the good food. You feel me? We eat the good stuff. We're not out here buying Walmart food no more like we used to. You know, we upgraded our minds, our thinkings, and our lives. So, we like, okay, we can use this EBT to get some good food. I feel like they're understanding that and they know that people are are out here doing that. So they are trying to take that from us. They're trying to take that option away from us. Like, OK, instead of letting them go buy the food that they want, we're just going to give y'all food. Why y'all going to give us some box food? Like who wants some boxed food? Like y'all going to put in like what I, I was just watching a little news review. I seen them putting in like sodas and canned foods. Like, who wants to eat canned foods? Who wants to eat canned goods? Beans and and sodas and and all that trash, that garbage that y'all feeding us, and all of this stuff affects our bodies, affects our moods, affects everything. You know what I mean? So, I mean, everything affects affects us as people that we deal with out here in this country. You know what I mean? So, I really just think that's a really dumb decision for people to agree with replacing um, box food with the, your EBT. But at the same time, I was kind of just like, you know what? Just how they did everything else. Just how when Donald Trump became president and all this stuff and people was mad and I was cool with it. I was like, you know what? Let him be president. It don't matter who the president is. You know, they don't care about us anyway. They're going to do what they're doing anyway. It don't matter who the president is. This gives us a chance to see what's really going on and who they really put in the office and how they really feel about the people. And it makes us more amped up to do better for ourselves. You know what I mean? Do right. So this is my this is my situation and what I'm going to push on the people and what I'm going to continue to do if this really happens. If they really take food stamps away and try to change it for EBT, I mean, for some box food, we're going to promote like we already been promoting, but we're just going to go harder because we got to go harder because we see what they're really trying to do. And they're trying to push it, push it, push it. We're going to promote growing your food to the max. You know what I mean? Grow your own food. We're going to push it on people like how they push eating burgers on us. You know what I mean? Like we're going to promote it. We're going to advertise it. We're going to we're going to say you don't have to have a backyard. With grass in it in order to grow your own food. Yes, mommy. Huh? Okay, hold on one second, okay? All right, get up here with me. Get up here with me. In the video. So, like I said, we're going to promote growing up your own food and taking back control of the food, of your food. You're not relying on anybody to, you know... Um, Give you food, you know what I mean? Like, there's a lot of things that we we don't need to rely on uh, the government for. But if we're going to be relying on them, you know, uh, for these things, then we want the best. You know, just how they want us to go to work and they want us to give us 
their be- our best, even when we sick, even when we not feeling it, they still want us to go to work. They still want us to do all these things. So, like I said, if they replace it, we pushing grow food on the people like we already doing. So grow your own food, eat healthier. If you got EBT now, make sure you're going to go get you some good stuff before they take it off. You can buy chips and all that cheap stuff with your money, you know. So take care of your body. Take care of your mind and more things will start to flourish in your life. You know, we still working on everything. We still trying to get better. We still trying to calm down and uh, be more calm and be more chill, meditate more, read more, you know, doing all that good stuff. You know, we, we're getting back into it and we keep, we're just keeping these things on our mind. So, again, y'all, self-sustainability is the new era that we are ent- entering to because we see what they're doing. They're taking away Walmarts anyway. They take they taking down uh, already a couple Walmarts out here in Sacramento. They were talking about 16 Walmarts they're taking down and and Sam's Clubs and Toys R Us. We, we see what's going on. You know what I mean? And if you don't, well, then you sleep and you're not paying attention. You keep, keep living your life how you're living. You'll, you'll see. But all right, my people. It's Mr. Lewis. Subscribe. Make sure you check out some of the music. Make sure that you check out some of the talks and all uh, the cooking videos that I got. All the good stuff. You know what I mean? Just check it all out and let the people know what's good and how we get down. Conscious Minds, Charge the Castle, you know, uh, uh, PTLL, all that good stuff. You know, Israel Family Farm. We pushing it all, man. You know, so represent.